Alright everyone, welcome back to the Combustion Gamer YouTube channel in NASCAR 21. And today we're going to show you how you can win the Food City Dirt Race at Bristol Motor Speedway without doing hardly anything at all. Why? Because, well, you can't really drive the track as it is anyways. But anyways, that's how we're going to do it. So we're going to show you how to do it and we are going to be in the beautiful number 36 Chevrolet super clean and Cabela's car that's why it's super clean but hey I've been wanting to make a super clean car for a long time of course Motorsport Games decided not to give us any text or letters or anything to be able to use so I had to make my own little sponsorship so hey you know what it's supposed to be super clean the great the world's greatest degreaser and cleaner you know the deal but anyways people we are sending it to the dirt track to see if it can make a clean sweep of the competition so we're gonna move the, the uh, thing Mahoogie up here to like uh, five percent, and we're gonna go all racing with all the cars. Let's go racing up Bristol! All right, guys. So here we go. So this is how you're going to win at this track without hardly having to do anything so a uh, very simple thing we gotta do here we're gonna get into the correct camera lens we're gonna drop on down here let the cars go on past as we get hit from behind uh, maybe we'll just go up I don't know here we go we gotta go up though and we're just going to run the wall so I actually kinda wanna be in this particular camera lens so as you go through the turn and you're running you're gonna to want to make sure that you are in uh, make sure that you are steering to the left as you hit the turn and look at that you're gaining ground already so it makes things fairly easy you're gonna to want to make sure that you watch out for AI make sure you don't get spun out as you go into the straight but look at how much ground you can make up as you go along make sure you don't get spun out though because that is going to ruin your race but uh yeah look at this honestly guys this is the only way that i have found i can even remotely race this track so probably in like career mode you might actually see this i'm gonna call it like wall riding or something i don't know oh that's a cool blicky car that's a, that that's an interesting scheme wow okay but yeah so Guys, this is the be honestly, this is the best way. The car does not drive at all on this track. I don't know what we can do, what the, the what Motorsport Games can do, but the car simply does not drive. It doesn't drive. I cannot drive. It doesn't work. So I've tried like uh, being in manual shifting. I've tried staying in the lower gear. The car just it's like on it's not it's like it's racing on ice instead of dirt, and it's not fun. So. If you're gonna want, if you're wanting to race, this is the best way you can do it. As I take the lead from Ryan Blaney in the number 36 Super Clean Cabela's and Craftsman Tools car. Ah! Also got some loves on there. Great gas station. As we keep on running around. But yeah, so as you hit the turn, you want to turn to the left, so that gets you the best speed through the corner. And then you're gonna want to kind of let off so that you stay near the wall. And see right here, you're already turning left before you even hit the wall and that keeps your speed up uh, so that you're able to keep consistent speed and keep all of the AI behind you. As I said, uh, the worst thing is the AI, just trying to make sure that you don't get yourself spun out uh, by the AI on the straights. That's, uh, that's where things get tricky. But other than that, it's fairly easy to win, as you can uh, see. So is this a, a, a cheat? Am I doing an Alex Bowman and being a hack? Uh, yeah, technically, but honestly, the game drove me to this, so... Uh, the game drove me to this, that's kind of funny. I'm the guy driving the car right now. That, that That's a pretty good one. Okay, but yes, uh, this... <laughs> yeah, I know, it's stupid. It's stupid, but this is the best way that I have found so far. I haven't seen anyone else been able to race this track either, honestly. It's like... Um, yeah, I, I've tried looking for stuff, but I have not found anything on how to do this. So, by the way, if you want to see some dirt racing in which I can actually do well, you can check out some of my Tony Stewart 
um, All American Racing, other videos like that. And see right there, the AI wrecking me, that is what you gotta look out for. That is the problem, so. Alrighty, so we gotta get back up to speed, we gotta get back on that wall there. Hopefully not get spun out again. Ah, that's not gonna help me out at all. So yeah, that's that's the uh, worst thing that can happen, guys. Oh, look at that. The car's getting dirty. That's kind of cool. Ooh, we got the Eric Jones Tide Machine back there, so I need to get back up on my wall here. There we go. But yeah, the worst thing, as I said, is the AI. You gotta watch out for those guys, because they will wreck you and not have any mercy whatsoever, which is not helpful whatsoever at all. But yeah, you can gain a lot of speed depending on how you enter the corner each time. So see, not turning, turning. So see, you can get to like 109 miles an hour getting into the turn. So it just depends on when you start your turn. And you can get some really good speed. So like right here, we're going to start a little bit early. Now you got to watch out for that because if you hit it too head on, it will cause you to have a severe uh, spin out. And that will not help you out in the long run whatsoever. And by the way, uh, as I said, the one thing that can defeat you is the AI. That's the one and only thing that you gotta worry about is the AI, because the AI can destroy you. As I come, so I'm gonna get third here, but that's because I got spun out by the uh, AI. But yeah, that's that's how you do it, guys. If you want a good finish, I guess I shouldn't say guaranteed win. If you want a good finish, you gotta run the wall. That's the only way you can do it. So, anyways, guys, that's. That's how you're going to want to be able to do it here. So let me see. I want to change. There we go. So I, I hadn't noticed. Well, the dirt isn't. I don't know what's going on with the dirt, honestly. The dirt looks kind of weird. But anyways, but yeah. That's, that's how you're going to be able to do it, guys. Just by staying on that wall the whole time. So, anyways, let me know what you guys think about that video. So, uh, it's, it's only, it honestly is the best way I have found to even remotely be able to compete at Bristol Dirt. So, guys, let me know what you think about that, and we will see you guys here, hopefully, uh, next time on the Combustion Gamer YouTube channel. Thanks, guys, for watching, and we'll see you guys here next time. Bye-bye.